answer for you. Uh, that white filtering, uh, white powder filtering. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> this is not from Master Troll, but uh, uh, from, uh, uh, he is the PhD guy from here, actually. He went back and he is actually in charge of natural farm, I mean the organic farming uh, institute in Korean government. He invented sort of a <coughs> very simple, cheap, and a very effective way. That's uh, egg yolk seed oil. Egg yolk seed oil. Uh, <coughs> what you do is uh, egg one egg yolk, not the white one. Egg yolk only. Glass of you know just one glass. You put one egg yolk. Put a little bit of water and buy some hand mixer from Walmart, I think about 20 bucks or so. Then the hand mixer, you just put it in there and then turn it on the electricity, and it like that, about three minutes. The purpose of that is to make this egg yolk tiny, tiny, tiny particle. What the egg yolk can do is it's a sticker. Also, it gives a nutrient. So egg yolk does that two functions, nutrient and uh, sticky function. And then after three minutes, you get seed oil. What kind of oil? Seed oil. What kind of seed? Any kind. Cheap is the best. <laughs> Cheapest is the best. <laughs> I try to get the cheapest for the soybean seed oil. They used to have a, a, a KTA, cheapest one, but nobody buys it, so they don't <laughs> carry it anymore. But the idea is that any seed oil has the functions to, to repel those bugs or insects. So that's the idea. We got, you can use canola seed oil, you can use sunflower seed oil, you can use, as I said, if you have a soybean seed oil, that's good too. So any kind of seed oil has this repellent <coughs> function of the insects in general. So you put the seed oil about 60 cc's or two ounces into that one egg yolk, okay? So you just add it, the seed oil, 60 cc or two ounces in there, and then hand the mixer again, another about five minutes, okay? So three minutes plus five minutes, how many minutes? Eight, Eight minutes. Eight minutes, it's already a done deal. And you put it into the knapsack, five gallon knapsack, into that. You dilute it to five gallons. Five gallon water. Then you spray. About once a week you do that as a preventive uh, way. This is a preventive way of just doing this aphids, mites, white mildew, uh, powder mildew. They said that's a very efficient. Uh, if the already have this infested, then he he recommend to instead of two ounces, you put hundred cc's, which is a little more than three ounces. Okay, so I don't think it's going to be harmful, but he studied this is as a research. He studied so for the preventive way, you use two ounces treatment already happened the disease, you get 100 cc into that, you know, same one egg yolk. And then you spray the same way. Once a week, maybe five, or every five days or so. And you diligently do that, then you have a lot of control without too much expense or very efficient way. Yes. Thank you very much. Would you mix that with other ingredients? Uh, 
uh, to do it just spray once, or would you do that only al alone? And one more question: How often is it recommended to to spray regular Cho ingredients? Five days, seven days. This is a separate one, but it, I don't think there is no harmful if you mix with it together with a Cho's ingredient, which is OHN, brown rice vinegar, uh, fermented plant juice, and mineral A, stuff like that, yeah? Uh, so it's not contraindicated to mix it, because as you can see, egg yolk, there's no more har harmful uh, chemicals or anything like that. But as I said, this is not from master troll. <laughs> so uh, to answer that, this, uh, uh, frequency is every five days, every five days to seven days. And that's what that he recommended to use it. And, uh, Does it need to be mixed up fresh every time, or can you have too much, say, like uh, two gallon backpacks? I didn't, I didn't uh, do that, but you know, if you get five, uh, five gallon at a time, so I understand that. I think he used up, you know, it's, it's, it's so easy, you know, if you have three minutes for five more minutes, that's, you know, eight minutes, so you can remake it, you know? Yeah. So unless you have so much time consuming, then you're thinking about story. Yeah. But I think you can make it each time. But I didn't ask him the question, so I have to be honest.